Well, this flu season is just getting into full swing, and the Coconino County Health Department says the number of cases is way up over last year. That's right. The flu season starts at the beginning of October and runs until May or June. We're joined now in studio by NAZ Today's Michaela Clark. How many cases have been confirmed so far? Well, Jessica, at this time last year, Coconino County had three cases, and this time they're already at 40. When we talk about the flu, we're talking about more than one strain of the virus. The two main types of flu are influenza A and influenza B, and there's a variety of different influenza A's uh, and different influenza B's. And so uh, if you do get one type, uh, you might still be able to get the other one. The flu vaccine can protect you from more than one strain of the flu. You can avoid the virus by also washing your hands frequently, staying home when you're sick, and covering your mouth when you cough. Sometimes, though, it's hard to tell if you have a cold or the flu. The symptoms are similar for both, but with the flu, you will also have a fever, muscle aches, and chills. And with a cold, you'll be sneezing and coughing more. Common cold is uh, caused by a variety of other viruses. Uh, and then the flu is one in particular virus uh, referred to as influenza. There is more than one treatment for the flu, but Tamiflu is one option to help reduce symptoms. Tamiflu is a, uh, an antiviral uh, medication uh, that, uh, that helps to uh, decrease those symptoms that you're experiencing because of the flu. The only way to tell for certain if you have the flu is to have your doctor run a test. Flu shots are available through your health care provider or through the flu clinic at the Coconino County Health District. Michaela Clark, NAC Today.